Welcome back guys to another episode of Hollow Knight and I took the trek back to Dirtmouth and we're just going to check a few things out. First there's this NPC and she's just chilling. I don't know if we can actually talk to her. Okay, this guy's still here. Let's go talk to Sly. See what he has to offer. Let's, let's spend some of our Geo. Definitely want that. Uh, what else do we want? Sprint Master, Heavy Blow, Stalwart Shell. He has another? Wow, he gives up out a lot of mass fragments. Let's actually hold on to our Geo. We'll come. Mm, let's go ahead and get Heavy Blow. All right, let's take a look. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Is that fifteen on the money? I think that's how many we needed to get the charm notch. I think it was. Oh. What was that? Akala, Imtono. Didn't mean to talk to Elder Bug, but we did. I don't think the cartographer has anything new for us. <sighs> Bye for nada. Warrior's Grave, Tram Pin, Scarab Marker. So this is all, okay, nothing that we really want to get. I still don't know what's in here or what the point is. So we've already read that. We're not going to worry about that. So what we're going to do now is go down to Grubfather. Now, we have triggered the inf infestation of this area. So the enemies are going to be slightly different. And they're also going to be a lot tougher. Yeah, and that explosion will hurt. Uh, my main recommendation is just to fuck right off in this area. Alright, let's see what kind of prizes we get from Grub Father, because we've gotten a lot of grubs so far. Look at all that Geo. Oh my god. Oh, Nest Seal. Holy Christ. That's pretty good. We got a lot of Geo back out of that. So he does give us a Pell Ore. I, I, we have to free so many grubs, and when we come back, we'll get a Pell Ore from him. Alright, let's peace out. Uh, where I want to go next is actually to... Uh, I wasn't paying attention. It's too... Let's just get the fuck out of here. That other vendor. I cannot remember that vendor's name. But if we look at the map... Looks like we can go to Forgotten Crossroads. And head down from there? Or is it easier to go... I'm not sure. But right there in the middle of the screen, that's what we're trying to get. Is it easier? I don't know. I don't don't know. Actually, yeah, it probably is easier to go to uh, the hell is it called? Resting grounds. Oh! Oh! So we'll take the stag way all the way to the resting grounds. We're doing a little bit of cleanup and a little bit of upgrading right now um, before taking on any taking on any new areas. So what we want to do is go 
to the left, but we don't want to go straight down. Don't think there's anything in here to worry about. Yeah, we want to go down right here and then continue to the left. Blue Lake. It's a long little ride. There we go. And this should spit us out right at the uh, vendor we're wanting to go to. I wish I can remember that vendor's name. Yeah, here we are. Ah. Uh, Give me that charm notch, baby. Oh, so delicious. This one we need 18. Well, we have 15. What if I just buy these three from you? Does that unlock it? Yes, it does. Dude, two charm notches. That's what I'm talking about. This one we need 25. So we have 18. Oh, uh, we need seven more. All right, and we'll get that last charm notch. So let's 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 stick around with our loadout real quick. Oh, come on. So if we look at our charms, ooh, this is worth four. So we could. So this does. That's worth three. Increase the power of spells, dealing more damage to foes. Greatly increase the amount of soul gain when striking an enemy with a nail. So if we dip that out, we can actually use that and that'll fill us up. But this is worth three. This gives us a lot more options to uh, when we get to boss fights. But this is the same basic loadout we had. It's just this is a more powerful version of that. It seems. I think we'll stick with this for now, and then if we come to a boss, we can rework it. Okay, now what we want to do. Let's look at our map. We've done Grub Father. Alright, we want to go to Crystal Peak. So what, we really need to get back to Dirt Mouth, but there's no real good way to do that. Ah, oh, shit. Because we can't, I wish we could jump back up there. Ooh, we may be able to. Aha, yes. Skill jump. But now all we gotta do is... Ooh, there's actually, oh yeah, I think we've already been to this area. That was probably the long way. Oh, it's so long. There we go. The reason I'm doing this is because we're going back to Dirt Mouth, but this is probably the quickest way to a uh, tramway for us. Because fighting through all that bullshit and... Uh, this way. Yes. Fighting through all that bullshit in uh, Forgotten Crossroads now... Uh, it's a real pain. Also, they blocked off a couple passages in Forgotten Crossroads now that make you go the long way around, uh, depending on where you are. And so it, it's just, to me, it's just too much bullshit to worry about. When we can go this way and not have to worry about fighting anything or nothing like that. Don't need that. Alright, take me back to Dirt Mouth, please. Alright, so we're gonna go up. Okay. 
so we're gonna go to Crystal Peak to what do you got to say? Give me that soul or essence. I got six essence out of that guy. Oh motherfucker. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, I do want to use a simple key on that. Let's just check it out, see what's in there. Maybe worth checking out. Really? Hey, NBC. Oh boy, oh boy. GG. Uh, are you gonna give me anything? Are you gonna? What are you doing? Oh, ah, darling. Oh, so I think what that NPC does, if you, if you die and like your shade is like somewhere tough and you can't get it back you can pay I think you can pay that NPC and you'll get your uh, shade back but I don't remember if you get your geo back That was close. Oh, we can get that now. Oh, come. Fucking bullshit. What are you? King's Idol. That's another one of those items we can sell. To the vendor in City of Tears. And we do want to go up. We'll go ahead and hit this bench up real quick. Since it's right here. Just in case something happens. And we're trying to get to the very top here where we haven't been. Uh, the reason we did not. Oh, oh, let me through. Nothing. Okay, I thought we could get through right there. The reason we didn't go this. Woo! Well, I tried not to get hit, but we did. The reason. We, let me finish my sentence. The reason uh, we did not go this way is because we didn't have a double jump and we couldn't get up there. God damn it. Which would be... I was just double checking that. But we do need to go to the right. So we can't get up there, obviously. But if we continue through this way... You little dickhead. Alright. It was here. Yes. Whoa, what the fuck? I totally forgot about that enemy. Or type of enemy. Woo! Thank God we kill him in three hits. Appears to be something down there. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, we canceled their little charge attack when we strike them. That's good to know. Let's kill everything in this area. And then let's take out the tree. I guess we can go ahead and strike the tree since we're right here. I wonder how many we'll get. We 
need to get to a hundred because that's what the seer wanted us to get. We may get close. Oh, motherfucker. That's all of them. So we got the 87. That's pretty good. Well, let's go to the right. There's a lower level to the right, or a lower path to the right, and then there's an upper path to the right. I don't know if they converge. We'll check it out. Yeah, I wasn't about to deal with his dickhead self. So. What the Ha! Hey, little grub. Okay. So that's what the lower path was. Oof. Skill jumps, man. Now we need to go up. I'm glad we checked that out. I didn't not I did not remember that was a grub down on that bottom area. Those little laser beam dudes, they're pretty cool. They suck, but they're pretty cool. And we're making our way across. Don't fall, we're good. Yeah. And we're through. Oh, whatever. There we go. I still haven't figured out a real good way to kill those guys without getting or without taking damage. Bitch. Heal up. All right, back to full health. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Come back down, baby. Yeah. That'll work. Taking care of the trash. All right. Sooner or later, we'll hit the top of this damn thing. Okay, that works. Heal up real quick. Whoa, how the fuck are we supposed to do that? Okay. Nope. Nothing there. Come back down, little bitch. How far? Okay. Yep, you did. Okay, that works. This has got to be the top, right? Yeah, certainly it is. Hollow's, hollow nest's crown. All right. 
what is this way? I actually know what this item is, but I'm gonna pretend like I don't. What is it? Treasure! Pale ore. Yes! So now we can upgrade our Nell again, which is what we're gonna do. So we're gonna go, if we look at the maps, we're gonna go all the way down to the City of Tears, and we're gonna hit up that black or Nell Smith right there. And probably call in an episode. I think so. So I don't know the quickest way down. But I'll probably just cut to uh, the Nailsmith so you guys don't have to sit there and watch me. What is this? We haven't been here yet. Oh shit. We uh we walked into that one. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, we found the boss by accident. Luckily, we're at this bench. All right. Well, I guess we're doing this instead of the Nelsmith. Uh, we're going to take that off. We're going to take that off. We have two charm notches left. Uh, let's see. Um, heavy blow. Ooh, which one's better? We'll do that one. I guess potentially this one. So I was like, hey, that looks like an area I haven't checked it out. I was going to check it out just to see if there was any loot there, but fuck, there's a whole. I've taken damage. Son of a bitch. Oh my god. I Okay. Alright, we can do this. We've beaten this enemy before. But I think we're gonna have to do We're gonna have to do quick focus. We can get rid of that. We don't need that long nail. <sighs> that gives us that, that. And let's do we can do that and that. Let's try that out. The quick focus is gonna help. Phew, that two Two hit points per hit sucks. Doing okay. Oh, whoa, you fucking got me. That was well played. Oh, God damn. All right. Oh my god, he is fucking annihilating me. Every time I fucking focus... Okay, that'll work. Jesus Christ. 
I'll take the fucking Geo, thank you very much. Is that a vessel shard? No, that's a mass uh, fragment. Dude, that's what I'm talking about. One, oh my gosh, we're doing good. I'm glad we came up there. Dude, that dude hit like a fucking truck. Holy shit. Alright, let's change our loadout again. No, actually, fuck. It was this one. This one and the thorns. Oh, now we're going to the Nelson. Jesus Christ. I'll see you guys there. Please upgrade my nail. Ah, Ranjo Stenja. I do have some pelt ore. Woo, my God, 2000. I knew it was going to be expensive. John Shot. Garadel Akari. The forging is complete. And if we talk to him again, he'll say we need, I think, three pieces. Yeah, three pieces of pelt ore. So we can only upgrade our nail one more time. But if we look at our inventory real quick, we now have a coiled nail. So now it's like even more powerful, obviously. Those guys are dying in one hit now. Oh my god, I, I didn't get a good judge on how powerful it is because of the the vine charm that we have. I want to find one guy to test it out on. One, two, oh my gosh. These guys are getting wiped out now. Alright, well, looking at the time, we're going to call that an episode. We made some pretty good progress. You know, we got, we're able to upgrade our nail, got some charms in, man. So we're, we're, we're on our way to completing the game. Uh, so we're going to hit up uh, a couple areas in the next episode that uh, we've been to, and then maybe go back to uh, the uh, Kingdom's Edge or whatever it's called. So yeah, if you enjoyed this episode, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Later, guys.